perfect. Like. Hello Sycamore Junior High, today is Tuesday, May 24th, 2022, and welcome to this episode of our daily video announcements. I'm Hanin. Hello all, happy Tuesday, only eight more days of school. I'm Ava, now stand again with Mrs. Dworkin's class, kiss our right hand over heart to say the Pledge of Allegiance together. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, Please be seated. As we mentioned yesterday, we are approaching Memorial Day weekend, where we, the United States of America, honor all of those who served and lost their lives defending our free country. Everyone show your support and wear red, white, and blue this Friday, May 27th, to start, to start the spe special Memorial Day weekend. Our 8th graders start f first thing Friday morning with a Memorial Awareness Day ceremony at the Blue Ash Bicentennial Veterans Memorial Park. Weather permitting, they will walk in the red, white, and blue to the park during their first bell class. Yes, I will definitely be wearing my red, white, and blue. Also, eighth graders, the high school dance team's mandatory informational meeting is tonight at, at 7 p.m. And everyone, remember to complete the final thought survey in the new school communications classroom. The survey will remain open until the end of the week. Today at 7 p.m. Is, is grades 5 through 7 orchestra spring concert at the high school auditorium. Go support our award-winning music program. Special thanks. We want to take the time to thank Lily for all her new school projects this year, and we will miss her Head of the Week segment until next year. Now, on to our aviator-specific national day. Today is National Aviation Maintenance Day. On May 24th, on May 24th Aviation Maintenance Day, Technician Day honors the men and women who have worked behind the scenes of making and keeping aviation possible. As the Camor Aviators, we all know the story of Dayton, Ohio's Orville and Wilbur Wright, Kitty, Kitty Hawk, and the experiment of human flight. But how many of us know the name Charles Edward Taylor? He came to work for the Wrights in 1902 when the research turned to powered flight. The automobile companies couldn't supply an engine both light enough and powerful enough for flight. He created an engine strong enough to power modern-day airplanes. Aviation truly has a colorful history. Go Aves! Now for the fact of the day. Zydronus Sovacus was the strongest man ever, and he was able to tow a 28,530-pound truck. That's really interesting. Again, remember to complete the Phonathon survey. Your input matters in decision-making. This survey will stay up until Friday, May 27th. Also, make sure to check out the new daily survey posted on our Google Communications Classroom. Next up, birthdays. Happy birthday to Anusha B and Hana H. We hope you have a wonderful day to celebrate. Now over to our wonderful and magnificent Mr. Harris. Good afternoon, Sycamore Junior High, and welcome to your video announcements. You guys only have a few more days to hear me say that again, you know, unless some of you be having nightmares about it and all that other stuff. Hey, this is just a reminder, we'll be having our Memorial Day Awareness Ceremony on Friday, so we'd like everybody, everybody to wear a little red, white, and blue coming up on this Friday. So this is a reminder, put that in your heads. Also, remember to check your email daily. Get those updates from athletic announcements, uh, school and club information, especially for the eighth graders that are going to be freshmen at the high school next year. Also, remember, all library books, all library books are due ASAP. So if you want to take part in the 8th grade day activities or the 7th grade movie day, make sure you have all library books returned to Ms. Carter as soon as you can. That's it for me. I'm out of here. See you guys tomorrow. Bye. Now over to Khadija and Cece with the random interview segment. Hi, my name is Cece and I'm here with... Lily. Okay, our first question is, do you prefer big or small dogs? Big dogs. And why? Because you don't trip over them. <laughs> All right, our first question is, do you like big or small dogs? I like all dogs. We don't discriminate against dogs. Yes. Yeah. Don't discriminate. Agreed. Hi, I'm Khadija, and I'm here with... Isaiah. Okay, so do you prefer big or small dogs? Oh, um, small. What's, what about you makes you unique? Probably my glasses. Okay. Um, and what do you think makes you unique? 
Um, I play sports. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Have any uncommon food combos that you like? No. Um, and what is an uncommon food combination that you like? Um, I like pretzels and ranch dressing. Okay. <laughs> What's your favorite school event? What has been your favorite school event? Um, I liked the fun fun Because it was fun? Super fun. <laughs> what was your favorite school event? Um, the fun fun Okay, I could say the same thing. All right. That was, <laughs> I'm Khadijan. That was my interview with Isaiah. <laughs> What's for lunch today? For lunch, we'll have spaghetti. We'll also serve chicken patties. I don't know about you, honey, but I'm ready for summer. Yeah, this horrible weather the past couple of days is really making me wish it was summer. Now for the joke of the day. How do celebrities stay cool? How? They have many fans. <laughs> <laughs> Go, Go Waves! waves.